I'm gonna send a thousand letters just like this to people who own properties that I wanna buy this month and I'm gonna show you exactly what happens. Let's do it and see if I make any money. Hey, how are you? Good, thank you. Good, could I get a thousand stamps? Yeah, a thousand stamps. A, a letter costs you about a about dollar is what it's gonna cost you to get a letter in the mail. You're gonna have to pay, in 2023, you're gonna have to pay 63 cents for a stamp. Can't go to any website and get discount stamps or whatever, those are fakes. They're illegal. Um, I just use the basic little American flag stamps. An envelope for five cents, sheet of paper, one cent, printer ink, some pens, whatever it is. You're gonna spend probably about a dollar. So it cost me a thousand dollars. First off, why would I do this? I'm a real estate investor. I buy commercial properties for cash flow and financial freedom. And the best strategy I found to get me good deals, to build my wealth and cash flow is to send letters to off-market property owners. Now, an off-market deal is somebody who's not currently looking to sell their property. So I'm kind of just sending these letters out and be like, hey, you thinking about selling it? Cool, my name's Hayden, give me a call. First, I wanna tell you a little bit about my system. I handwrite the letters, I send them out, and I have a phone number on there. It's not my personal cell phone number because I get a lot of spam calls. And I always wanna be able to answer the phone call when somebody calls me, right? If somebody's calling me from a letter I sent them, I always wanna be able to pick up. So I use an app called Open Phone. I think they charge you like $150 a year or something like that. And you'll always know if somebody is calling you. So you get a specific area code, put it on the letter and whenever they call you off that you'll know it's somebody calling you from a letter but let's talk about what actually goes in the letter it's very simple it says something along the lines of you know hey Dave my name's Hayden I'm a real estate investor I'm not some big company I'm not an agent looking to get commission I just want to know if you've ever thought about selling your property if you have your property looks exactly like something I'm trying to buy give me a call and I'd love to talk with you about it here's my phone number that's pretty much my whole pitch and again you don't get a lot of people responding but let's talk about exactly what does happen how many people respond off of the thousand letters that I sent I got 21 phone calls okay that's a 2.1 percent response ratio now I know you're probably thinking 2.1 percent that sounds awful but if you're talking about cold marketing marketing to people who don't have any idea who you are haven't raised their hand and said yes I'm interested in whatever it is that you've got 2.1 percent is amazing so I got 21 phone calls and without a doubt, some of those people called me to say, hey, my property is for sale. It's probably worth a million. And if you'll pay me 2 million, I'll sell it. I'm not really looking for those people, right? I got another percent of people who said, hey, don't ever, don't ever send me another piece of mail, right? So I'm like, okay, well, maybe I don't really want to send that person a piece of mail anymore. I also got some people in there who said, yeah, I'm interested. And whenever I said, okay, great. So if you want me to make you an offer, can you tell me a little bit more about the property? so I can make you an offer. And they'll say something along the lines of, well, let me think about it and I'll let you know next week if I'm interested. But at the end of the day, I got five deals, five different properties out of the 21 that said, hey, I'm interested. I'm willing to talk about you know, a reasonable price. I'm not expecting some crazy off the wall offer. Um, and I'm willing to do the work of giving you the information, having a conversation about my property, the ins and outs and the details of my property. So I went through, I used my property stats, I analyzed the deal I looked at the information out of those five I ended up making four offers because one of them just didn't make sense for me the property was probably too small I want a property to be able to make me at least five thousand dollars a month once it's all said and done in order to make it worth my time so the property probably did not get there so I made four offers and out of those four offers I got one person accepted my offer so I sent a thousand letters and I got one person who at the end of the day went far enough through the process of me and said, hey, I'm interested. And yes, I like the offer you've got for me. I will accept that offer. So one person, one in a thousand. Let's talk about this one deal. This one deal I'm buying for $4.7 million. And I think the potential upside on this deal, the amount of money I can make when it's all said and done is around $3 million. So this one deal, this one in a thousand deal can make me $3 million or it can also make me 20 grand a month. I cannot think of a better place to invest $1,000 than in direct mail 
to off-market property owners. So if you've ever asked yourself, hey, I've got $1,000 or I've got $10,000 to invest, where's the best place that I can invest it? My answer, the best place to invest it is in direct mail. Now, does that mean that you're gonna get a, 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 a deal for every thousand letters you send? No, it might take you 2,000 letters. It might only take you 200 letters. It's a numbers game, right? You can't say for certain that I'm gonna send this many letters to get a deal because that's gonna lead to discouragement. What you do need to say to, say to yourself is you need to set a goal for yourself. I'm going to send X letters a month or X letters a week to be even better and more consistent until I get a deal. And who knows, somebody may call me in two months and say, I got your letter and they may end up making another deal, right? But at the end of the day, I've done over 17 deals off of direct mail, big commercial deals. It all have seven figures in profit and you as well can do the same thing. There's no, there's no rules on who can send direct mail or not. If you're looking for permission to send direct mail, I'm going to give you the permission right now that you need to get out there and start sending these letters and deals. If you have any questions, let me know. Uh, I've got some other videos on my channel, like how to use property radar, which is where I find the people. If you need any help with any of this, drop me a comment below or, or shoot me an email, Hayden at HaydenCrabtree.com. And I'm happy to help out. With that being said, I hope you found this video valuable. Go send some mail.